up uh, back on the video today. Today's video will be about Pfizer, ticker symbol PFE. Um, I want to say thank you guys for all the support on the videos. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe, and comment below. And let's get into it. So, the news first on Pfizer is one, the first girl ticket in New York. I think she is um, a nurse, I believe. I think she's a nurse. So, make sure you watch out for that if you're investing in Pfizer. Because whatever happens to her, like reactions or if everything's good, will have a big play on the stock. And also, um, the U.S. is thinking about buying more of Pfizer vaccines. So I think if they buy more, that will show confidence in the vaccine. That also might do good for the stock. And then, on Thursday, Moderna has their meat for their vaccine. And I think if it doesn't pass, like Moderna stock doesn't pass, that will show more confidence in Pfizer stock because Pfizer's did pass. So it might show Pfizer's um, vaccines more capable. And um, as if you guys watched my previous videos, I was saying that Pfizer stock, the proof of the vaccine might already be priced in the stock. So you would have expected Pfizer to go up today after getting approval and people start taking it, but it went down. So, like I was saying, I think it's already priced in. It's already priced in, so that's why the stock dropped. Also, they're profit taking right now off of these big moves. So I think the stock that's why it also started dropping. So my new entry prices are 39.50 to enter, and my exit will be 44 above the high. So I'm actually waiting to see how this week goes with the Moderna's vaccine, how the girl reacts to it, if the U.S. buys more more uh, vaccines, because that's all stuff you want to watch out for, and how their distribution is going. So, like, if everything's going out on time, the trucks are making the deliveries, because anything with the shipping or any, any delays or say they make 100 million and they were only make they can only make 50 million, that looks bad on them, so that will also bring the stock lower. So it's just a couple things you guys should be looking out for when looking at Pfizer vaccine, like the news and everything, because that will uh, influence the stock price. And also I'm looking at the RSI, which has been um, oversold, I mean overbought a lot. So it is due for some oversold time. And on the higher time frame charts, it's finally going down oversold. So on the higher time frame charts, I waited for it to drop below 50 on the RSI. And I think 50 would be around that 39.50 level. And then I'll wait for it to go oversold, crossing the 40 for confirmation. And then I'll probably get in um, on a play to ride it above 44. But I'll probably wait to around Wednesday or Thursday after some more news come out so I can have some confirmation that the stock wants to go up before I just get in and then get um, killed because it dropped so low. But yeah, those are my entry and exit for Pfizer. That's some news on Pfizer. I'll probably make an update later today, but I do post every day at 1 p.m. I hope you guys like this video. And also, none of this is a recommendation to buy or sell anything. It's just for edu educational purposes only. I'm just showing you guys what I do and what I think I see in the stock. So don't trade anything you see here on the video, okay? All right, hope you guys liked it. See you in the next video. Bye.